It's Friday, April 17th, and here's some of the news beyond the headlines. Recovery teams have gained access to the last debris field from the Malaysian Airlines flight that crashed in eastern Ukraine nine months ago. Dutch and Malaysian investigators say they will carefully inspect the remaining burn sites for human remains. Two of the 298 victims still have not been identified. Dutch prosecutors believe the Boeing 777 was shot down accidentally by Russian-backed rebels, but are also open to the theory that it was shot down by a Ukrainian Air Force jet. Greece is releasing thousands of migrants from its holding centers and allowing them to openly move about the country. The government made the decision because of overcrowding and poor conditions in its seven holding facilities. Greece is struggling with the influx of migrants arriving to Europe by sea. The European Union has already fined Greece 1 million euros for the state of its detention centers. Many migrants have nowhere to go once released. Some Athens residents say they are worried about the strain the newly freed migrants could place on the already weak economy. Students clashed with police during a protest demanding education reform in the capital Santiago Thursday. The demonstration started off peaceful, but some in the crowd grew agitated when police used water cannons and gas. Students demand free, quality public education and denounce political corruption. Chilean President Michelle Bachelet made kindergarten through high school free this year and is looking at a bill that will do the same for university education. India's cattle industry is worried that the ruling Hindu Nationalist Party's promise to ban cow slaughter will include all types of cattle. Prime Minister Narendra Modi promised a nationwide ban on cow slaughter during his campaign to win over the votes of hardline Hindus. India is the world's fifth largest consumer and second largest exporter of beef, despite Hindu beliefs that female cows are sacred. Check out the Vice News YouTube channel for more original reporting and documentaries from around the world. Aqui na nossa região, ela tá totalmente invadida, né? Pelos madeireiros. Tem guerra, porque se não tem guerra, nós não vamos ter a terra de volta de você. Se eles tiver de matar nós, eles matam, mas nós matamos brigando pelo que é nosso.